Sarah Obidi's ex-husband, Justin Dean, had just exposed Cora. Justin Dean said that the money that Cora collected from her fans was scam she scammed you people. That firstly, that that $55,000 that, that was donated to her in the GoFundMe account was not the price that the lawyer would charge. That is just a single hearing of the case which would charge $5,000. That's seven point something million. But Cora had already got him $55,000. Hey, that's the extra $50,000 that what is Cora doing with it? He said that Cora is committing a crime, that it is a fraud. He went ahead and said that Cora lied when she said that she couldn't afford or she would not be able to afford the fee because of the exorbitant uh, prices of um, attorney or whatever in the U.S. That Cora is a lie. That Cora has two houses. That Cora has two houses in abroad there. Cora bought two cars last year that she can afford it very, very well. He went ahead and also put Nancy because it's as if Nancy is doing too much. Because they've already gotten Nancy's now voice. Ha! Nancy better look. <laughs> it's just that you're there in Nigeria. They care for every day. Cora, Cora, person don't go hear word from your head. <laughs> Now he played Nancy's uh, voice notes where Nancy was saying that it's not as if Cora can now afford it. She can afford it. She can, she, she can pay for a lawyer, but she will not use that money for her children to pay. <laughs> yes. She can afford it. She can pay for a lawyer, but she will not use her money for her children to pay to fight this guy off. That's what he's waiting for. She has a, she has an army. She has a community. She has a community. Okay. So, so Nancy confirmed in this voice note that uh, Cora can actually pay for the money, but she cannot use her money for her children to pay. That that is what just Justin is waiting for. That Cora has an army, she has a community. Okay, Cora cannot use her money for her children to pay, but she will ask people to get take the money for their own children to pay for her. Nancy, be very careful. Though. They don't get you now on tape. They don't get you now on tape. But they don't carry and sue you and your sister. Yes, yeah, so Ankara is not in Nigeria. She's in abroad, same place that Justin Dean is. Justin Dean there is a citizen. Now they've said now this thing she did is fraud. That is actually fine. You know, things you can do in Nigeria and go away with it. You cannot do it and go away with it though. If you say this money is meant for this thing, they will want you to use that money and do that particular thing. If you use it and do another thing, it's a crime to them. I remember this guy now, this UK guy that put Nigerians into trouble, that said Nigerians are coming there to Japan and everything. You remember that they gave that guy money for asylum, and the asylum was meant for, uh, the money was meant for him to use in the UK. This guy brought the money to Nigeria, sent the money to Nigeria for them to start building houses and everything for him. When he was discovered, he was locked up, and I heard recently, Seth, that he has been deported. That's what happened. If it was in Nigeria, the case would be like this. Uh -huh. Nothing might happen to you, but did you see how oh, people just took, it's not to divest them. Because the money they gave you for asylum, he has used it to do another thing. Now, allegedly, now, according to Justin Dean, the GoFundMe money they gave you is higher than what you need. You just needed $5,000 and you asked for $55,000. And he is here telling you that it's a crime, that it's a fraud. Kora Sakwa Nyagin and Miri. Wash your eye. Well, I don't know. You can afford this thing. You and your sister. You people decided to come and do GoFundMe or GoFundMe. Maybe they don't for sue you. Maybe they know. You know, say America not be Nigeria. See the other guy, Jay Boogie. Jay Boogie that went and scammed us under broad daylight. He has his shield. He went to DBVL and it affected his kidney. This one, the other one. And Nigeria stripped money for this guy in his account. At the end of the day, it was a lie. Did anything happen to Jay Boogie? Nothing happened to him. He's still working freely all over Nigeria. That's Nigeria for you, but you can't do it in abroad. So all this is one that they do, one that they careful. Justin D had already said that you people scammed us, and through the voice notes that Nancy has been talking, that thing sounds implicating. So if you know you have the money, so why not pay it? And I said it already in my video yesterday, that the only reason Cora don't want to pay for this thing, she feel the money will waste. I said it, and Justin has confirmed it also. She feel that money will waste. Why would she not hear yeah, your if not the thing not can work again? Her children money will come they go. So that we will now we will come bunala your, your wahala with your husband. Eh? And he has already said that you went to Hawaii. <laughs> Immediately you collected the money, you go to Hawaii. 
the point of this video is that Korea should be very careful because you are not in Nigeria where anything can slide. You are in abroad. Scoot your bills. And Nancy is saying that you people, oh, no, that's your man. Una be army. We are soldiers, soldiers of the cross. We are marching now. We shall conquer. Uh -huh. Soldiers army. Una no, una, una no get what you that they use money to do. I know some of our relatives now don't get money. Hunger, they kill them. They don't have shishi. Una no go give them. Na carry they give person where, where gets more than on a generation. Make what I receive sense, these internet people. And some people are saying that just see this in, uh, uh, what is it called? Uh, jealous, everybody's jealous. If you talk about Pessy, they're jealous. Everybody, me, I don't know for the two of them. The thing is that Justin is the weapon fashioned against Korea. That's why before you marry someone, no, the person where you will marry. Because this guy is not backing down anytime soon. Anytime he sees Koma on Korea's body, he will bring it out. Oh. He will bring it out. Oh. <laughs> she needs to be very careful of the truth.